So, if you ever get a USB drive, you've uh, thrown Linux or some kind of boot media on, and it's showing, uh, it's an 8 gigabyte drive, and it's showing 2.8 gigabytes, or it's showing all these weird partitions down here. You go to try to restore it, try to format it again, and just gives you this disk is right protected thing. Well, you're going to need to use this part. And uh, yeah, it's on every install of Windows. First of all, this, this video is brought to you by NyQuil. Uh, go ahead and drink it whether you're sick or not. Whether you're know, feeling down or just want to have a good time. Drink irresponsibly. It's my medical advice. So, yeah, you open your, your command prompt, or you open up your, your PowerShell to get this part, or, or, you open up your, your Windows terminal with PowerShell, and you go in it, and you just type in disk part. You always approve that, and... You go through and you list your disks. Want to see what you have? This um, take gigabyte one right here. Disk one is what we want to do. So we're gonna do select disk one. Then we're gonna go through and clean it once it's selected. After that, we go through create partition primary. And boom. Now normally you you could technically go through and do the little like format FS FAT32 and format through here. But if you're lazy like me, after you've done this crate part partition primary thing, you just go in, um, go over the disk, you right click on it, you format it, now it shows the, the right amount. Do a little quick format. Don't have to remember anything else here. Goes through, and it just uh, it's gonna take a good second for this quick format. There we go. Format complete, and you're done. And if you want to be fancy, you can always go through this um, this old um, C Windows uh, System 32 folder. Has all of your utilities. You can always just double click it on here. You know, it's doing to look cool. Has all the other uh, utilities in here too. If you're uh, wondering what that is, and uh, Microsoft, they also have a really good, um, good set of documentation for it. So if you want to know the syntax, you know it's it's been around for 23 years now. It's replaced um, FDIS completely, and it's uh, it's pretty good. So yeah, I'm gonna go sip some Nyquil.